Mr. Chairman, Thank if I'm you. right. Yeah, um, I don't think there's any, no one would be surprised. I, I'm probably the biggest supporter of achievement for us on this board. Um, but I'm concerned about the way we're engaging or not engaging. This process, it's only going to work if people want this for their kids, if they think it's something good for their kids. And we have not made that case. We haven't even come close to making that case yet. Right. And the further we go down the road without making the case, right. the harder it gets because the more people feel like they're not being treated with respect and we're not looking, exactly. that we're trying to impose on them something that they don't necessarily understand or want or think is a good idea for their kids. So if we are going to do this, and I mean, again, there is no bigger support of achievement for us on this board, I think, than me. We, we have got to get out there quickly and we have to be more aggressive in, in making this case with, you know, not only community leaders who, frankly, have been calling me since Friday and they don't really know much about it, and if the, sort of the people who are plugged in don't know, I have a feeling that it's probably a lot worse sort of at the, at the grassroots. And, you know, we have to get out there and make this case because if, even if we were to vote to do this, even if we did this, unless the people in that community feel like this is a good thing, they're not going to embrace it and it's not going to work and the kids aren't going to get the benefit of it. And, well, other kids will get the benefit of it because other kids will apply, but the kids in this neighborhood, they'll end up going somewhere else and they'll go further from home and they may or may not get a better education than they're getting now. So, I mean, we really, we really have to buckle down on this and we really have to work a lot harder, I think, and to treat people with more respect, frankly, and to be more engaging and solicitous of them. And, you know, frankly, first to probably hear that they're upset that it's sort of this has been dumped on them, and then to really try to honestly address their questions because, I mean, there are a lot of questions. I, I, this whole community school interface, I mean, doc, Dr. Colin Rivas is right. I mean, this, this, it can be, you know, we can work these things through, but it, it, we have to, we really have to put our shoulders to the wheel on this, and we really need to work with people in a way that, you know, we have not done in the last, say, three weeks. And if we're going to do this by the end of the year, we really have to sort of ratchet up the intensity of what we're doing and really sort of dig in and do this and, you know, really engage people at a level where, you know, if we have to go door to door, talk to individual people one at a time, that's what we have to do. I mean, we can't just say we're going to have three meetings and if you come, you come, and if you don't come, you know, well, there it is. So I, I would really hope that in the next, you know, between now and November 19th, that we would really engage in some really hard work around, one, making people feel like, A, that we care about what they think, B, that we're answering their questions that they have, and C, that we're trying to convince them in an honest way why this is a good opportunity for their kids and not just something that a bunch of people sit around a table think is a good idea and we're going to dump it on them whether they want it or not. So, I mean, that, 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 that would be my hope and frankly, you know, if this comes back to us on the 19th, it would be my expectation that these things have all occurred and that this is such that, you know, if we're going to do this, we're doing it with it well buttoned up and put together, not sort of, you know, well, you know, we're working on the fly and we're improvising and we're getting things done. And I know we have the capacity to do that, it's just we have to do it. So that would be my, that, that's really my hope, like I said, it's my hope and it's my expectation and when we get to November 19th, I would, I, I'm, I'm hoping that, you know, the community sentiment that will express itself will be positive because we've done this and also that the reports that we get and the questions that Dr. Glenn Davis and other people ask will show that this has been done because if it's not done, I can tell you it's not going to work and, you know, it's going to be a wasted opportunity and frankly, it will be the kids who suffer because the adults didn't do the work. So, 